For this question, we're told in the figure, an electron accelerated from rest through potential difference V1, 1.0 kV, enters the gap between two parallel plates having the separation D is equal to 29.9 millimeters and the potential difference V2 is equal to 96.8 volts. The lower plate is at the lower potential. We're supposed to neglect fringing and assume that the electron's velocity vector is perpendicular to the electric field vector between the plates. In unit vector notation, what uniform magnetic field allows the electron to travel in a straight line in the gap? Since our electron is only going one direction, as shown by this arrow, we are only gonna have one value, and it is going in the k direction, so our i is going to be zero, our j is going to be zero, and we need to find our k value. To do this, we need to use this formula, b is equal to e divided by v. This is gonna turn into b is equal to our v2 divided by the separation, which is d, over the square root of 2 times k, which is divided by the mass, which is m. And we see here that we are dealing with electrons. So we're going to have the mass of an electron. And our k is going to be two values. It's going to be v1 times the charge of an electron. And we represent that with a q subscript e. If we rewrite our formula, it's going to look like this, where we have b is equal to v subscript 2 all over d square root. And then inside of here, we have 2 times v1 q e all divided by the mass of an electron. If we start plugging in our values, we're going to see that b is equal to our v2, which is 96.8 volts. We're going to have our d, which is 29.9, and this is in millimeters, so we have to multiply this by 10 to the negative 3 cubed. That's going to be now meters. And then we have our square root. And inside of our square root, we have 2. And this is times our v1, which is 1.07. And here it's kV. We need to make it just volts. So we have to multiply it by 10 to the cubed, and we're going to get volts. And then we need the charge of an electron. And the charge of an electron is 1.6 times 10 to the 19th coulombs, approximately. All of this is being divided by the mass of electron, which is 9.11 times 10 to the negative 31st kilograms. And this is our current function right here. This is the value that we need to plug into our calculator. So after we carefully plug this into our calculator, we are gonna get the value of B is equal to 1.7 times 10 to the negative four T. This is rounded, so it's an approximate. In our answer right here, it wants it to be in MTs. So that, therefore, we need to do a conversion right here. So this is gonna be over one, and this is going to be multiplied by 1t, and on top here we're going to have 10 cubed t, or mt, sorry. After we do this calculation, we are going to get that b is equal to approximately negative 0.17 mt, and that is the answer. The negative shows direction, but I'm not 100% sure.